Hey, amazing people. I'm Shaman Dejeuner. Really, hey, Starseeds. And this is my July 2023 Starseed Dash Cosmic Energetic Update from the Galactic Federation. I am recording this on Monday, June 26, 2023. It will be posted on Wednesday, June 28, 2023. It's all about cosmic insights. And I'm sorry for putting a little bit, bit more bass in my voice because I'm consciously channeling. And that's what the Galactic Federation wants me to do. That's the energy that they're giving me. My ear just popped like the wave of like, you need it in your life. So this is what I wrote in the description box. This July 2023 Star C Cosmic Energetic Update from the Galactic Federation is in tough love energy. So the bass in my voice are having me put, it's tough love. So it might come across harsh or blunt, but remember the loving energy attached within heart to these messages. Okay, Galactic Federation. Too many star seeds are not connecting enough. Too many star seeds are not tapping into their insights, their gifts, their abilities, awakening to who they're meant to be on a deeper level. You may know that you are a Palladian, but you're not connecting to the Palladians. You may know that you are an Anunnaki, not connecting to the Anunnaki. You may have a realization that you are connected to Atlantis, but you're not connecting to Atlantis. So you're not really tapping into your cosmic insights, which is why we have her have this base behind her voice, this energy behind her voice, and why we're having her do this July 2023 energetic update a little different than she normally would. It's about you connecting to your cosmic insights and we're going to have, have her do so. She's going to help you connect. That is the goal for this. It's literally the goal. So like the Galactic Federation said, they're having me do this July 2023 update a little bit differently. It's about your cosmic insights. So if you don't have water, grab some water. It's going to be energetically heavy. It's going to be energetically intense. And if you're not at a place in, or in a space where you can meditate, well, you may want to pause the video and come back to it when you can. Because I'm being told to have you really help you connect. And this is what I do when I speak, teach spiritual courses. Except for I have PowerPoints attached. I don't have a PowerPoint for this. And also when I um, read people, when, they're, when I have them connect to their spiritual teams. And the energy surrounding them. This is going to focus solely on connecting to the Galactic Federation. No other energies are going to be attached to this. And um, basically, you need to be able to get cosmic insights. You need to be able to connect to your Galactic family. To the Galactic Federation as a whole. You need to be able to know more than what you know now. For most people. What I'm being told is 80, maybe 70%. No, they're telling me 80 to 90% of people have a, a basic level of understanding. And now they're telling me to help them tap in so they can get more information from themselves. Because you do not need to go for, to anyone for outside assistance when you get information. And you may have someone like me that helps you tap into the, the way of doing so. But they are meant to help you progress on your journey. You don't always need them. Like for me, you may watch my videos, which I'm grateful for. And if I help you activate your connection to the Galactic Federation, that's beautiful. But you won't need me for information or confirmations or clarity because you receive the information directly from, your, from yourself and them through utilizing your gifts and connecting. And that's the point of this. That is the point. So basically, they're like, there's your name. You're going to help them connect. And um, I'm just doing what I, I am told. So I'm not responsible for what you were, were experiencing during this time. Because it's going to focus on you connecting. It's going to focus on you connecting to your cosmic insights. And I'm writing things down because I'm typing. Because I always type as I go when I record straight through like this. And it's basically, it's time. So 
it's time. Now, for this first go around, I'm gonna help you connect to the Galactic Federation, their energy as a whole. Like when I tap in when I channel Galactic Federation, that's a collective energy that I'm channeling. We're gonna do that first. So you can have just awareness consciously of what the Galactic Federation is doing as a whole. Not just your starseed origin or your ruling body. So what we're gonna do is focus on connecting to the Galactic Federation so you can tap into their energy. Then next I'm gonna help you connect and get cosmic insights from your ruling body. Now, if you wanna dive deeper into this, I have channeled readings available. I also have spiritual activations available. You can click the, um, the link in my bio to do so, and I can really focus on solely your energy and diving deeper into it. Now, cause this is a collective thing. Now, I want you to make sure you have water and sip said water, cause it's gonna be energetically heavy and it's important. Also, you may not wanna do this if you have things to do afterwards because you may not be able to be, do so. Relax, you need to relax afterwards. Now, I need you to breathe. I need you to breathe. I need you to focus. I need you to ground yourself in your energy. What we are going to do is ground yourself. I teach people in three steps how to do this. And you can do this on your own. My gifts and abilities and my purpose allows me to do so by helping other people, by invoking, it's a gift, but you can do this on your own with your own gifts and abilities and magic. I don't know if you can do this with other people. You may be able to, you may not. It depends on what your gifts are, but for yourself and your spiritual team, you can. Calling in other people's spiritual team, you may or may not have that ability. Now, as you're grounding yourself in your energy, breathe, allow yourself to be in the energy of receiving and being able to ground and be focused. And once you're grounded in self, I want you to call in the Galactic Federation of Light. Call in your, the ruling body for star seeds, the, the Galactic Federation. You're gonna feel an energetic shift. This energetic shift, the energy you're picking up on is the Galactic Federation's energy. It's cosmic energy. And cosmic energy is more intense, it's more serious. How is your body responding? Are you able to pick up on that shift? Are you picking up on the shifts? Are you picking up on the energy? Are you feeling it throughout your body? Usually when people feel it all throughout their bodies, that's a confirmation that you're a channel because you're channeling their energy. Or do you feel popping in your ears? Do you feel things around your forehead, your throat? Maybe you smell or you're tasting things. Those are just your gifts and abilities associating, associating with them, which is important. Now, as you, are, as you are consciously aware of their energy, hopefully you're picking up on it. If not, you're blocked. And again, I, act, I offer spiritual activations to help you unblock. I need you to ground your energy and just connect to their energy for a minute or so. I want you to be comfortable with connecting to the Galactic Federation's energy as you are doing right now because this energy is gonna allow you to know when that cosmic energy surrounds you. It's very distinct. You need to get comfortable in it for you to be able to tap into your cosmic insights. 9-11 was on the time. They're emphasizing the emergency situation towards you connecting to your um, to the Galactic Federation, to your cosmic insights, to your cosmic energy. So focus on honing into their energy. Focus on the connection. Focus on you connecting to your Galactic, to the Galactic Federation which is basically helping you to learn how to connect to your cosmic family. And I say helping because I'm going to help you focus on their energy next. Focus on the energy and get to know the energy. It's important for you to do so.
Become comfortable in the energy. Cleansing the space and energy as my other incense went out. This is sandalwood. Um, one thing that people say often and continue to, to connect is that they are afraid of connecting because they don't understand. When you focus on the energy of something, you will know every time you hear, feel this energy that the Galactic Federation is around you. It's a level of comfort you are able to have and discern. Now, I want you to ask the Galactic Federation of Light, positive energy, what cosmic insights they want to give you and allow yourself to receive the information. Ask, direct the conversation, direct the interaction, the Galactic Federation of Light, what cosmic insights they want to give you and receive the information. Be open to receiving it. If you're blocked, you need to unblock yourself. Again, I, act, I offer spiritual activations to help you with that. How are you receiving this information? Are you hearing it? Are you knowing it? Are you seeing it? Are you feeling certain things? These are all important because that's how your guest responds. If you're hearing it, you're clairaudient. If you're knowing, you're claircognizant. If you're seeing, that's clairvoyancy. Maybe you're smelling or tasting something. Smell is clair aliens, taste is clair gustance. And if you feel, if you touch something, you feel that's clair tangents, but you should not have that experience right now. Now, thank the Galactic Federation for making their energy and presence known to you, for you, and giving you that confirmation and clarity on the, on the cosmic insights you needed from them. Now, we're going to shift this a little bit, and if you need to, drink some water. Now what? Anyway, drink some water, even if you don't feel like you need to drink some water. And I mean that in the most loving, straightforward way. I'm blunt, I'm a Taurus. Now, I need you to reground yourself in your energy. If you know what your cosmic origin is, if you know you are a Palladian, a Lyran, or an Atlantean like me, there's other ones, you know. I want you to call in them. If you are not aware, by the way, ground your energy back into self again. You do this after you ground your energy into self. And this works best when you are grounded in self. Keep that in mind. Grounded in life and balanced. Now, if you know who you are and you are grounded in your energy, I want you to call in your cosmic family. Call in the Lyrans. Call in the Atlanteans. Call in the Anunnaki. Call in the Palladians, the Monacans, the Arcturians. You're invoking them and connecting to their energy. When you are ready and grounded in self, call them in. And then focus on that energetic connection. For those of you who may not know what type of star seeds you are, Ground yourself in your energy and ask whoever your ruling body is to make their energy and presence known to you. To receive that confirmation directly from yourself. It's important to know because somebody will tell you something and it may not be true. But if you get the information from yourself, directly from them, that is a confirmation that you yourself are giving and getting directly from them. So for those of you who know, call in that ruling body by name. For those of you who do not know, ask for confirmation of what your ruling body is. And again, 1444 on the time, stability, structure, foundation. You need to ground yourself and be grounded while doing so. And as you are calling in your galactic family, that ruling body, focus in and hone in to their energy. 
connect to their energy. This energetic connectivity is important because this is going to allow you to really tap in and connect and get to know their energy, which is important because, because the Galactic Federation as a whole has individual ener energy that's distinct. And so does your cosmic family. And you need to become comfortable in this energy. You need to become comfortable in knowing their energy so that you know as my body's getting goosebumps when they're around and that you're connecting to them authentically. Okay. Focus in on their energy. Connect to their energy. Get to know their energy. It's something you need to be comfortable in. It's something you need to know. For you to get for you to get cosmic insights, for you to receive clarity, for you to grow and develop as a star seed, align with your mission, and literally connect to your origin, ruling body, and the Galactic Federation. So focus in on that energy. Focus in, be open to receiving their energy, get to know their energy. Now, ask your cosmic family by name, because you should know which one it is. So, me, Atlanteans. What cosmic insight do you want to give me? And be open to receiving. By name, who they are, what cosmic insights do you want to give me? And be open to receiving. Focus in on this energetic connection. Get to know their energy. Be open to receiving information. Connect. It is essential that you connect. Allow yourself to connect and get to know. Because the cosmic insights is what the Galactic Federation is having me focus on. And they're having me do this reading, this energy for July 2023 differently. Because they want you to be able to connect. To connect. It's serious because that disconnectivity is there. Now, I want you to thank your cosmic family by name for making their energy and presence known to you. I want you to say thank you, insert name, for making your energy and presence known to me. And I want you to be in this energy of committing to connecting to them, to gather more cosmic insights, to get more information, to dive deeper into the connection, for you to do what you need to do as a star seed, to align with your mission, and really get to know your cosmic origins, your star seed origin, and dive deeper into the connection and align with what you're meant to do as a star seed. Thank them again. Thank you, Galactic Federation. Thank you my Atlantean family, thank you to the cosmos, cosmic energy, for allowing me to channel and lead this and guiding me to do so for this July 2023 energies. And um, I want you to start breathing and coming to now. Being more conscious, drinking water. Nineteen eleven on the time again. Like it's a serious energy for you to do so. Okay. So it's nineteen twenty four. They told me this wasn't gonna be too long of a message. So nineteen thirty. Galactic Federation. The energy for this July 2023 energetic update that Dejane does is emphasizing the importance of you connecting to your cosmic family, to us, the Galactic Federation, for you to receive insights on who you are, what you're meant to do, and aligning with your mission. 
building the connection to your cosmic family, to your rolling body, to your starseed origin, and to the Galactic Federation as a whole. It's a need, it's a must, it is what we are emphasizing for this and why we had her bridge this and do her energies like this this month. Take the time to build that connection to your cosmic family. It will help you align with your star seed origin, literally build that relationship. Also, and very importantly, allow you to get to know who you are as a star seed. Connect to your mission, connect to your cosmic gifts, give you personal insights into who you are, and connect to your cosmic family to deepen that, allowing you to meet your cosmic guide, to work with them, and really just help you as a whole. It's all about cosmic insights, and it's time for you to become more insightful. The Galactic Federation. Hey, amazing star seeds. Anyway, hey, amazing people. I just wanted to say, hey, amazing star seeds, because hey, 2111 on the time. This is going to be a more empowered time for you to connect with your cosmic family, to connect to the Galactic Federation, to align with your star seed mission, to get to know your mission, your cosmic gifts, to as your cosmic DNA is activated, activating, and to really build that relationship with your cosmic origins, your star seed origins, who you are, and the Galactic Federation as a whole. That is why they are having me emphasize co cosmic insights. It's time for you to become more insightful, to get information directly from them, to connect to yourself, and basically get a deeper sense of knowing. I hope you enjoyed this July 2023 Star Cosmic update from the Galactic Federation. It's a little bit of a different format than I normally do, but this is how I was led to do so this time. And again, I'm Shaman Dejeuner, and I am a representative of the Divine Council, which is the Council of Gods, Goddesses, and Deities, my voice almost went out. I am an Atlantean starseed, reincarnated member of the Galactic Federation, hence why I do this cosmic update, starseed as cosmic update. And I am an earth angel, light worker, mystic, healer that is here to raise earth's vibration, uplift humanity, and help people tap back into their magic and the magic within the universe. And in this energy is that cosmic energy who you are as a star seed and helping you get cosmic insights as you align with your mission as a star seed and get to know yourself and your origins as a star seed too. I hope this reading resonated. If it did, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, share, turn on notification bells. And I hope you have a great morning, evening, or afternoon. Ashe, I appreciate you watching the star seeds.